Hey vlog! Hey! She's back for another vlog. Cheers, by the way. She's back. Start vlog Cheers. with a coffee. Why is yours much nicer than looking at mine? I want some sugar. Try yours. Oh, you got it the wrong way around. But that looks as well like more oat milky. Sorry, we just got a bit of problem. That's it. Is it? And that's very good enough. Oh. Or is that oat milk? That's oat milk. That's regular milk. We but are in Alyssa Mykonos, we're in Santorini. This is going to be the Santorini vlog. Already got loads to tell you. We got here yesterday. Oh, yesterday. <coughs> and I've got a cough, it's not COVID. FYI. It's just, just got a terrible cough. It's cough. really bad. Me up all night. I've been like trying to hold it in. And now people are smoking to be fair, next so it's just oh, it's so coffee. annoying. Like, I'm never ill the week I come on holiday. Get a cough. It's such a long story, and I feel like we need to explain it in a bit because yeah, we'll we've got to copyright music and we can't do it explain our, it right now. But in our new long room. story short, we're waiting for our <coughs> waiting for our room, even though we were here last night. Mm. I love people ask me about Santorini, so I want to make this vlog as informative as possible with regards to like where to go out for food, where to go out for dinners, what places to stay at. We're in an area called Kamari. There's like three main areas of Santorini: Kamari, Oya, and Fira. Well done, um, God, you're a Santorini expert, you are. Geographically. <laughs> but Kamari's more like boho, like on the beach. It's like a different vibe, it's a more like chilled vibe. So we'll see how we get on today. I think we might be swapping the coffee for an Aperol quite soon. Or Prosecco. <laughs> Hello vlog, I have a top on. Please do not be fooled. This bikini is PLT by the way, and I love it. And they do it in loads of different colors. It's really flattering if you're maybe like smaller on top and curvier on the bottom because it's a bandeau style, which is great for tanning. And then it's like high-waisted. I mean, how flattering is this? It's the most flattering bikini. And I'm definitely not in that like bikini mindset. Like I've not been going to the gym. I've not been eating great. I just was not in that. It's not a cat by the way, it's Phoebe. I was just not in that bikini mindset. So yeah, I really like this one and I will link it below. The trousers are also PLT for those of you wondering, just really comfy, loose trousers. Here's the cat. I just wanted to explain because we started the vlog at breakfast and then we disappeared. We're actually in our room right now. So we got here late last night. See you in a second, hon. We got here late last night and long story short, they wanted us, we've paid for this whole trip by the way. Um, not that like, but I, the reason why I say that is because like people are like, that one was gifted and that was gifted and this was this and this was that. No, 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 this whole trip we paid for. We booked it through Destinations too because we had a voucher that we were meant to use for a holiday that got canceled during the big C. Anyway, we get here and the guy, the guy who like owns the hotel checks us in, really sweet, everything's a vibe. And then he was like, oh, we want you to stay in this room for the first night. And then we want you to stay in another room for the second night, which both were like nice rooms. But it, I think they just wanted us to like obviously promote those rooms and then go to our regular room. And it's like, we're only here for seven nights. Like I would just rather get the room that we booked and just stay in it because we have so much baggage and stuff to like unpack and repack is just such a faff. I know some people probably won't agree and they'll be like, oh, I wanted, I would have wanted to stay in like the nicer room for, for the night, even if it is for the night. But I just didn't really feel like that. I was like, I'm happy with the room that we booked and just to like get all our stuff out. I mean, we've got so much stuff and just like chill a bit. So, God, I'm literally rambling on all night. Anyway, we are now in our room and I'm gonna do a really quick room talk because I do wanna get outside in the sunshine. We are staying at the Santorini Castelli Resort. I have previously stayed at San Antonio, which is in Oya, and I've also stayed in Bolognese Villas, which is in Camari, which is the area we're in. Bolognese Villas is literally like right there. And my sister and Bella are actually staying there. They put this trip after us. Uh, me and Phoebe have had this trip booked forever. And I just sort of mentioned it to my sister and they booked it, which I was obviously really happy about. Sorry, I don't want it to look like I've not got a top on when I have. So, so far I would say like they're very neck and neck, Bolognese and Castelli. This hotel's more of a resort, so it has a big spa. It has multiple swimming pools. It has a lot more stuff. Um, than Bolognius, but Bolognius is right on the beach and you get sea views from your room and from the pool and you can have access directly to the beach. So it's like swings and roundabouts. Like I feel like, yeah, it swings and roundabouts. But I'll let you know throughout the week what I'm thinking. I mean, this was more expensive than Bolognius and this is considered a higher star rating, but the Bolognius breakfast, it did it for me. It did, I'm just keeping it real. San Antonio, I have so much to say about it. It is honestly probably the nicest hotel I've ever stayed in. 
would have stayed again but the price was crazy but i mean if you can stay there like off season or if you get a good deal stay in san antonio suites because it is just amazing and the staff there are so nice and your knit oil which is a really nice part of santorini enough about me i mean i've been talking for about four minutes this is our room here's the door walk in this is the bathroom very blue very santorini hello match my swimsuit shower loo bed is here and then this is the nice part uh see if we can see phoebe we have like the biggest balcony and it's right in the sun as well hi phoebe phoebe there's phoebe <laughs> so yeah really really nice um little balcony area definitely a vibe and we're just really happy to be settled so i'm gonna take you guys to the pool we're gonna chill and just get on with the day i'm very excited phoebe did get some pics for me which i'm just trying to figure out what one i want to actually post quite cute i thought in the trousers i mean a good thing about holiday content is just so easy to get because of the song hi everyone really cool. yeah. taking over her vlog again i think she's forgotten about you i'll remember i remember you guys um this is our view right now stunning views Say hi guys. Hey. I've got black all around my eyes. This is now my channel. Yeah, so you, you and Bella have smashed it because, sorry, we're having a bit of a chat about content. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Hey guys, apologies for this look. Again, I do have a top on. Looks like I don't, but I do. I've got my lace. I've got a fan to lemon in there, but more importantly, I've got a Nurofen, antihistamines, and a swollen hand. And a, I mean, look at the size of that thumb. I mean, it probably doesn't even look that bad on camera, but bloody hell. Just got stung by a wasp. Trust me. It landed on my bikini and I like, went like that. I didn't even realise it was a wasp until after I'd gone like that and it stung me right by my nail bed. Like, it stung me literally right close to my nail bed. Um, so frustrating because if it was literally on the nail, it wouldn't have been able to sting me. But yeah, it stung me on the nail bed and i don't have the greatest history with wasp and bee stings i've had cellulitis before from a bee from a wasp sting um which whatever i say that everyone laughs and they think i'm saying cellulite no cellulitis is like an infection that you can get from stings when like the sting is infected or just like yeah not great and i was on a course of antibiotics and my hand was so swollen like honestly it was like you know when you blow into a rubber glove that's how my hand went and it's almost like the same place that i was stung i stung my bees and had bad reactions. i've just always had really bad reactions to any sort of sting even like mosquito bites i react so badly my whole body just swells up which is really frustrating because obviously we're on like day one and i'm like i really don't want to have a whole swollen hand and like potentially it'd be a little bit more serious for the rest of the week I'm keeping an eye on it. I did just have a bag of ice, but the ice just fell all over the floor. Honestly, mercury is in retrograde. I'm not complaining about my holiday. Please don't think that. I'm just saying I've just been stung by a wasp. And if you have been stung, it hurts. Yeah, the lovely lady that was sitting on the beach kindly had some tweezers because they're. I went to my sister's hotel and they had nothing. Um, so she like pulled it out with the tweezers. Um, and I was like, I've been stung. And people was like, no, you haven't. I was like, I've been stung. Because like, if you've been stung, you just know how painful it is. Okay, who thinks Jude should keep this outfit on? She's actually having. Okay, this is the. This is. Oh, it's gone blurry. Say it. There you go. Done it. Okay, so this is the reality. So we've not unpacked yet. Just long story. We, we're doing it. After, we're doing it later when we get back from dinner. We got move rooms. <laughs> so this is the reality of the situation. Oh, I can do this. Are they ready for the bed? I don't think you're ready for the bed. <laughs> So somehow we've got a like, <laughs> okay, this side is Georgia's, that is mine. That's a bit more, you know, be, be, okay. I've been having a fight, I got into a fight. My case needs to be unpacked, can't wait to unpack. I just don't know where anything is. And this is Georgia getting ready. Do we do which outfit number is this? Seven. <laughs> when, the, when that's her clothes, she's got literally a month's wear of clothes. Do you think this? No, no, I didn't do it. Up. It was the little crop. I need to do it. Because the actual one doesn't like vlogging. Do you know what it is, guys? I hate my outfit tonight and it's really bringing me she's, down. She's very um, self-critical. I'm not, I'm not for normally. For some reason. And I'm she looks normally. great. I just, so I don't really I just, understand. I just don't like it tonight. I just feel... 
I don't know. I think she looks unreal, as usual. I don't know. But you know, it's one of them things. Look at her though. She looks, she looks like a so I'm more of a dress person and I put shorts on. <laughs> if you are someone that's more of a dress person or a skirt Yeah, but you've person, got your dresses for the, like, get me. the middle of the week when you've got a bit of a nicer tan. Yeah. And then we're going to go so, nicer places. We've got like, quite a few nights, so I think that's why we were a bit like... I feel like we should just wait here for them. For the girls. I don't know what the heck they're doing, but I have no photo. We're waiting for them. They've decided they don't want to come and meet us. We're yeah, going to have to okay. go to theirs. Hey vlog, I'm currently stealing Bella's sort of light because where she sat, the light's great as she is, by the way. Hello, guys. <laughs> Been very Phoebe's with us, as you can tell. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Yes, lovely, thank you. Um, yeah, Phoebe's here. I nearly said the man, the myth, the legend. The woman, the myth, the legend, not the man. Ah, <laughs> oh, my man. <laughs> I knew. I lives there. Hey, love the baggers. Thanks. Honestly, I have used this bag so much. Really good. I mean, obviously, it's, it's a dupe. It's Olivia. Um, Olivia Sales? Yeah, Olivia Sales. What is it? A dupe? Um, oh, yeah, sorry. Yeah, but it's like. Oh, I'm They're having a moment. Anyway, I don't know when the last clip was <laughs> in the room. <coughs> We've had no, a mess. No, we are at this Italian restaurant that we've been to before, we really like it here. Do you know what? It's just, we're all having a little bit of a mare tonight, but it's all going to be fine. I think we should just enjoy the night and start again tomorrow. Yeah, I down the wine before I left, so I'm going to eat Yeah, I think. I'm just gonna get up super early and just figure it out in the, in the yeah, hotel, and it's fine. Sorry guys, I keep hiccuping, it's really bad. But yeah, we ordered our food. I got the pesto pasta because I just really fancy a big old bowl of pasta. Probably not in these denim shorts, but I do fancy a big bowl of pasta. Got a big old aperol here. Phoebe's on the rosé all day. Just gonna enjoy our evening. Really cute. The sunset was like kind of here, but it's obviously kind of gone now. It kind of goes behind this big rock that's like there. So I feel like we sort of miss it, but when we go to like Fira and Boya and places that, we've got to be on it when we go to places like yeah, that, guys. that's why I'm saving all my like... And we did get the bait first cheese. Yeah, yeah babe, take. Pizza, tzatziki, pasta, baked. How do I get... Are we, are we just dipping it? Just dip it in. Just dip. Just dip. Just dip. Triple dip. Go on. I don't think I showed you guys the moon. I don't know. I can't remember, but that is the moon. The moon. Yeah, we just had another, I just had another apple. Now, I think we're gonna go to a bar or something. There is a shop here though that I love <coughs> called Bavem, and they do really nice jewelry. So, I kinda wanna look in there. And they do like beach bags, like beachy things. So I'm like, and maybe I can change my outfit in there because I'm just not vibing it. So maybe I can buy a new outfit. <laughs> I actually know I'm joking. By the way, for any of you watching this vlog and you're wondering, where is that Italian restaurant? Where did they go? It's in Camari, it's along the front, and this is what it's called. There you go. And it's like, this is what it looks like, so you guys can kind of get an idea. My camera will not focus tonight, but if you get the vibes, it's like a little alleyway there, and then that's the restaurant. <laughs> Look at the colour of my face and my body right now. I'm just really paranoid about burning my face and getting <coughs> wrinkles. Can we do all these black marks all over my eyes? Was yours bonnie hot oh, out here, Phoebe? We're gonna go to sleep. We're exhausted. We've got lots to do. We want to sit in the sun tomorrow because it's 26 degrees all day. Alright. Thank you. So the girl I used to be. Her days are over. So Phoebe is You know what, I'm hungover, Phoebe is um, ill. Not COVID, FYI. Yeah, I think I've said that, but. It's just, you know, you know coughs that existed before COVID, that's what I've got. Tell them, Phoebe. I will. You tell them. Anyway, hi guys. It's actually half past one the next day. I am hungover as hell, but Phoebe ordered a shandy and I felt peer pressure. How's the dog in it? So I ordered one as well. It's so refreshing. I honestly cannot handle hangovers anymore. Like I just saw the girls, my sister and Bella, because they're in their youth. They <coughs> can they're like Gen Z and women millennials. Yeah, like they can night. hack it. Do you know what I mean? Oh, thank you so oh, much. Can. Thank it's you. Yeah, 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 yeah. For taxation issues. Sorry. <laughs> thank you so much. Thank you. Um. Anyway, I just saw them and they're like living the best life, and I'm like, eh. We didn't make breakfast. That wasn't English. We didn't make breakfast. We're doing alright though. 
We're going to talk about the pool. I'm going to get in the pool and do some... We've got a rebel on our hands, guys. Swimming. Oh my god, I'm feeling it today, actually. Bloody hell. Hey, vlog. How y'all doing? Um, I just did an outfit of the night and I thought I'm going to do one here. This isn't what I'm wearing, but I'm going to go shoot this with Phoebe. So, uh, God, I'm trying to prop you guys up on my crappy tripod. So I thought I'd just show you here on YouTube. If ever you want to see my outfits on holiday, please follow me on TikTok. My username is georgia.mayx. Um, and I'm getting so much more into the app. Like so much more into the app. I'm using it so much more regularly and I'm doing outfits on there non-stop. Please check out my TikTok to see proper full outfits. This dress is an oldie that I've never worn and I just found her and I love her. This is Tula Rosa, she's sold on Revolve. How cute is this little back detail? Can we see that? Currently have my bra on because that's just how I want to shoot it. Kind of want to do it a little bit like off the shoulder, very like, oh here I am in Santorini, that kind of moment currently i've paired it with my favorite all-time shoes i adore these i'm so happy i got these gucci shoes kill it for me like these are a vibe i wear them non-stop but i was thinking of pairing it with my new babies that i've been wearing so much this trip i only brought two pairs of shoes with me so these are getting battered and bruised but do you know what i'm just here for the, like things deserve to be worn so these are my lv canvas shoes i Love. Cheap to be fair, the Gucci's are a little bit more of a good price point. Bag, I'm gonna use my LV bum bag. This is an oldie but a goodie. She's cute, she does the job. Sling her over the arm. And that is the outfit we're gonna go shoot. So I'm not actually gonna wear this out. I've got a different outfit that I'm gonna wear out. Let me actually show you what I'm wearing out. So I'm actually going as Phoebe, sorry, Phoebe's watching an interview with Harry Styles, so I don't want to interrupt because um, he's her boyfriend. But, no, 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 I just feel bad for you because I'm nattering over the interview and I know how much... Yeah, I need to have... Clean. You need to have full yeah, um, concentration on the interview. Yeah. This is the dress I'm wearing, it's from ASOS Design. It has this really pretty crisscross design up the back and I'll show you guys it on once I have it on. I feel like it's the perfect wedding guest dress. Um, well, not like the perfect, but like a good option. Do you know what I mean? And I think I'm gonna do a low ponytail that's gonna be waved. So I think I'm gonna use the Lulabelle's hair for that. I've been using their hair so much this trip because it's just been so much easier to do my hair, but I'm um, here for a little bun top knot, actually. Phoebe, do you know what you're wearing tonight? Yeah. Or we're not sure. But that doesn't matter. We've got time. We've got a bit of time. It's... Nice time. We don't have a bit of time. It's 20 to 7. Told a big fat lie. Uh, hey, vlog. We're having a mare. Bells is here. We're both dressed like cucumbers. Hello. Both got green. Green vibes. Green. Oh, my gosh. Oh, gosh. Are you all, all right? Hard, Thank yeah. you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, hi. Hi. We are just getting in our, I just said Uber, but obviously, it's really no, problem. Oh, oh God, technical difficulties. I feel so much better now. I felt like death earlier, but we're all here. Ready to go? It's hot in here. Yeah, it's It's pretty damn hot. Oh, my God. 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 Oh, Catch up with us when we get to Vera. Sun setting, and as soon as I've got this vibe of us, as soon as we walk up there, that's where the sun sets. I'm not gonna be like, I love a sunset, don't I? I love it, and yeah, I just don't it's rock. emotional and that sort of thing. I, do, I get quite emotional. Me and Liv cried. Yes, cry. yeah, that's sweet. Yeah. I didn't cry, but there's potential because I love a sunset. The sunset don't just get gets me in the feels, especially when there's like music on. Oh. oh my god, that would be dream proposal. Okay, if you're listening, he does what um, as well. Music, sunset, yeah, family know, rents for after. Like that would be not for the moment. Not for the moment. The moment oh. needs to be private between the two wow. of you. But afterwards, it's to celebrate, you know. <laughs> but then again, would you want them there, honey? Yeah. Up your would you want your parents, honey? Like, or your family, yeah. Up your engagement? Not really, not. At the end, yeah. They can think about it. I think, yeah, but definitely not for the proposal. That would give me a lot no, of stress. No, yeah, maybe like in the evening, like you got proposed to in the day. Yes. What have worked for you? Last, well, not last year, two years ago. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. 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 Except you are in front of the sun. Okay. Hey vlog, we're leaving now, but I just really wanted to show you this view. There's a helicopter flying over there, which is kind of amazing. Maybe someone's getting proposed to. The girls are saying, here's a lovely Phoebe. She's in her poly dress. Yeah, I'm gonna put You're in no poly dress? No poly. 
lo we love it. She's loving it. And a little crop blazers from Man from Manchester. No. A little bit. Okay, well, it's not, you're not doing very well. That's kind of rude, isn't it? Oh, is that V Lounge the one that's full? Oh my gosh, there's a festival going on, guys. There's a lot happening. Look at this, though. You can't complain. Get okay, you to join in. Ooh, to join in. I'm living for it. Wow! Oh, wow! This is amazing! <laughs> Hey. So we're in, I keep calling it VU Lounge, which is like, I'm not gonna lie, a very different vibe in Hertfordshire. If you've ever been there, comment below, it's, this is not VU Lounge. This is V Lounge, and it cracks up because it just reminds me of my mum. Sometimes I call it V. So this is the vibe. I've tried to do a little video. I mean, we are at the back, but that's our own fault. We got here really late. Um, and we weren't organised, but you guys can see. I mean, look at that sunset. And then this is the little houses. And this is just the whole vibe here. So, like a big street here. And there's loads of different places to eat and drink. Really cute. So on the way up here, we got invited to a Greek wedding show. I bet it's so good wow. as well. Yeah. I, bet I actually bet like it is. Sorry. <laughs> Actors, dancers, singers, musicians, and you. An interactive musical. I bet it's wild. You have to reserve by phone. We are leaving the bar. We haven't had any food. V Lounge. Yeah, shout out to V at home. We came here. I'm gonna actually take a picture of this for my Instagram stories. Go left, no? Okay, hey guys, this is mine. These are the girls. Hello. 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 Oh my god, guys, my mum literally has, not this size, <laughs> but my mum has three of these little ones in her house, and I have three of these. The size of an actual baby. That's, that's my mum has them, I think they're about this size, my mum, or maybe they're smaller than this. What's she doing, the split? The, the... I have the, uh, no, I have see no evil, hear no evil, speak no evil, but they've got like little teal, <coughs> sorry guys, that incense has gone right to the back of my throat. But this is such a cute shop, and if anyone's wondering where we get this stuff, it's always from Santorini, and then we just pack it and figure out the problem on the way home, but you know. Has live in the store. Hey. Okay, so a debate here. Georgia got dressed up this, this evening. Woo! <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> because got my dress green, up this evening. Because it's green, I went, oh, cucumber. Is that offensive? I don't think so. <laughs> because it's uh, green. I think it is. I think it is. What's wrong with the cucumber? This is the restaurant we went to, by the way. This is what it's called. It looks like Blackpool, doesn't it? Did you hear that? Camera. Camera. What does that mean? Um, I'm assuming it means camera. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna take a wild guess. This is the view. <laughs> Come to a jewelry store. God, I do look a little bit crazy in this light. I just bought this little bracelet, the blue one. I don't know why you guys can see it, but they have loads of stuff here, like all these little bracelets. I also bought this ring, which I love. I put it on the hand that I got stung on, which was really stupid, but it's a little snake ring. Oh my God, I love it. Yeah, super cute. Right, guys, I won't be able to film for long because we've got copyright music. I feel like we're on Magaluf's trip. Yeah, I feel like I'm in line. What? What's This is day, no, this is night number two. Well, it's kind of night number three for us, but the first night, I feel like we don't really count. We got here on Sunday night at like nine o'clock. Yeah, so technically it's night number dos. We went to Fira, it was so pretty, I love it there. Really good vibes, nice place, but we had dinner quite late because we sort of watched the sunset and faffed about. Typical us, sorry I'm trying to take this out. I'm having a fight with it. Just want to give myself a nice head scratch. Um, yeah, and we ate, end up eating really late. 
which then meant loads of the bars were like kind of closed because there's like a little strip that was like a lot more busy. Of course. I've got two. I like you, I love this one. It's a little bit. I love the skin of me. I love Elements, but I, I love Skin and Me. Like, I really recommend them if you haven't tried them before. Anyway, did that. And then we just had a sangria and we're all like, well, I was quite tired. Phoebe's tired, obviously, because she's not been well. So we were just fucking tired. We came back and I'm so happy about it because it means I'm going to get up nice and early <coughs> and enjoy the day, read my book, have a nice breakfast. Like, that's my plan for tomorrow. This is an update on the wasp sting. My thumb is swollen again love that for me but you know we're just gonna rock and roll and i uh, will check in with you all in a bit morning from the egg <laughs> shiny egg hi guys i don't know when i ended last night's video video part of the vlog uh we obviously went to fira and we had some dinner at what's it called again guys i always forget the name Riss, Riss. Riss. Oh. <laughs> it was um, like, yeah it was ramos I was going to say Ristorante and that's definitely not the name of it. Ragget. Rassatoni? Rassatoni? Yeah, Rassatoni? I don't know. Do you know what guys? I'll leave it below. I think I took a photo of the name of the restaurant. Um, but it's really, really nice there. Again, it's Italian. <sighs> Sorry. We are, three of us are vegetarian so we are suckers for an Italian because just guaranteed like good food but i think tonight's is a lot more fish i'm so excited for tonight we are going to a moody bay i think if you come to santorini um even if you're staying in like thera or kamari or oya wherever i do think a moody bay is a worth a visit it's a little bit more of like a trek to go there just because for where we are as well it's like the opposite part of the island but i just think it's so worth it it's so worth it like it's just so pretty there and Oh my god, I love it. So I'm really excited to bring you guys along to Moody Bay. If you've been here a while, I think I might have vlogged there in a really old video. I'll try and leave it below just for entertainment value, but yeah, it's so nice. And it's a lot more like seafood fish kind of vibes because it's right on the beach. Um, I've come to the girls' hotel today, minus one. Phoebe's still in bed, so I thought I'd come because I really want some breakfast. And our breakfast is like not hitting the spot for me. So I'm back at the hotel. I do think if you can get a deal, you need to stay at this hotel. Just keep it I real. It, is actually, it trumps it for me. It is amazing. All the like the staff and everything. Like, mm. It's like the kindest people. Like they're all. We literally said they're like the whole parents. I don't mm. like. <laughs> yeah. Like, yeah. Really like kind, very attentive. Just chilled energy as well. Something about it feels yeah, instantly very, relaxing. Yeah, very relaxing. You don't feel like stressed, like I've got to get bed or I've got to, like no, any nice. of that. Or not. Yeah, like, it's just nice. No rush to be like, we're going to the bed. Yeah. Yeah. Our breakfast is here. This is very beautiful. I look like such a pain. Livy, <laughs> you don't. <laughs> like so Although I might just pinch a tiny bit of the apple. Sorry. Yeah. Um, wow. Well, this is better. Oh, is that my, oh, it's different to the other day. Fruit salad. Oh, I thought you got Greek salad. No, I got fruit salad, but it's different. Mm. Um, I'm at that stage of the day where I'm like, so sleepy. Oh, God, I'm going to stay awake. Hi, vlog. We're leaving there. You know what? Being a holiday is nice. It tires you out, doesn't it? We're in that, like, um, sun drunk. We're sun yeah. drunk. Like, what, 20 past four in the afternoon. Oh, I, like Gee, I want to do that with you. I want to do that. Should we do it on the weekend? Yeah. And yeah. So we People can are canoeing. There's a company. Yeah. I'll find it on Instagram. We're going to do that. We're making our way back. We spent the whole day out there. So I've, I've literally spent the whole day there from like nine, nine o'clock this morning. I kind of get my words out. It was actually really nice. And like I looked in some of the shops and it was just cute. Yeah, there's all super cute hotels along this bit in Kamari. And then... I wondered that. I wondered that. Should we go and sit? It, no, it says Oxygen Hotel. Damn. There's all places to have food. That would be so good if we could cut through there because that's literally where our hotel is. But yeah, I love Kamari. It isn't, for anyone that's wondering, Santorini is not sandy beaches. It's like... I think I did get one. It is. Hi vlog. This is the setting. This is the restaurant, Sunset Taverna. Um, and this is where we are and it's 
absolutely bloody gorgeous. Isn't it, Liv? I love this dress you've got on, someone might ask. It's from Mushiki. It's really, really nice. Um, I wore it in my bathroom. Yeah, it looks great. Also, my flash is on. Mm -hmm. Second hello? I think my nip might be out. <laughs> I'll tell you if it is. Hi, guys. <laughs> Cheers. 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 Woo! Cheers. Um, Thank you for telling me. So. Which, to be honest, it's like a little bit ashy at the moment for me. I think I'm kind of in between <coughs> shades with them at the moment. But this is nice because it cools down my hair a bit. Anyway, we're having so many chats here. But what I've come on here to actually say is, nice firstly, sorry I didn't bring you to a moody bay. I couldn't fit you in my handbag. Another thing that happened while I was away <laughs> is my hand officially went into... Meltdown. I mean, look at it. I mean, it probably doesn't even look that bad on here but it's swollen all here and it's getting like pins and needles. So I was like, hmm, doesn't sound right. So I was like Googling it, worst thing. But I have had cellulitis before from a wasp sting and I just knew that that's what was happening. So I went to a local doctor, paid hundred euros for a course of antibiotics and some steroid cream. He wanted to do, th he wanted to do three cortisone injections into my thumb and I was like, no, thank you very much. Um, that's not happening. So we'll have to keep an eye on it. And if it gets worse, I'll have to go and have the cortisone injections. Anyway, we went out. Do you want to tell the story what happened? Mango bar was an absolute vile cow. Never go to Mango bar in Santorini yet. If you come to Santorini. Okay, I'm going to say it in a more PC way. Um, well, not PC is not the right word, but like a more, a less. I don't think there is because she was that vile. You, there's nothing nice to say about the experience of the bitch of the girl. Basically, long story short, we went out, we came back to Kamari, we were like, oh, let's have a drink. The karaoke bar was a bit naff, so there was nowhere to sit. No, but it looked good, but there's nowhere, there's nowhere to, to sit. sit, and it was a bit naff. Sank smoke in there. Was it? Was smoke. Um, so we went to Mango Bar. The girls ordered things, drinks. Anyway, one of the things they ordered, it wasn't right. My drink wasn't right, but I just didn't say anything. I was just like, please, can I have some Prosecco in here? Just like, there's Prosecco in here. And I was like, I, I know when there's Prosecco and there's no Prosecco in the supper at all. But I just didn't want to be rude. So she brought me a little shot of Prosecco and said, if you ever, no, if you, if you need something, you need to ask. And I was thinking, well, I just did. So I'm really confused. <laughs> started off a little bit weird and then Bella had like a light and she went like that and got really annoyed about it and it wasn't in her eyes or anything it just all was very strange anyway long story short the girls ordered something it was disgusting they complained the man admitted that there was something wrong with it that it was disgusting but he couldn't take it off the bill because it's at the discretion of the ma waiter but he admitted it was he was like it's faulty this is not right and he worked there and then she was like no you're gonna have to pay for it um, she was banana. It's such a lot. Oh, it's such a long story. It is. It is. Basically, like, if, honestly, if anyone was there, they would have actually. Agreed basically, with you guys, though. Like, I you think. Were. Long story short, if you come to Santorini in Camare, don't go to Mango Bar. Well, no, because I we met some people that owned the bar that were really nice. Yeah, but the, but the people that really were really, were really like. She started going. <laughs> at the end of the conversation, she started going, "Fuck this, fuck this, like this," and it was just like. <coughs> What else was she shouting? She was just telling us how we're rude. I don't know. I just paid for my drink. And she was like, girls, if you don't like something, you just pay for it and leave. And I went, yeah, I didn't like my drink, but I just paid for it and I'm leaving. <laughs> and it was full. Like and you, your food's cold. You send it back, they bring out a new one and it's warm. Mm. I don't know. They just handle it very badly. Very badly, but. Can I see a makeup wipe? No. Thank bitch. you. This is what I want it to look like. This is what it does look like. Let's see. It doesn't look as red though. <coughs> Cost me a hundred euros. But they were really nice. And if you need to go to a doctor, hit me in Santorini, hit me up and I'll give you this guy's name because I've got his phone number and everything. Anyway, we're going to bed now. I've already raved about this perfume on TikTok. Have we raved about it here on YouTube? This is stunning. We bought this in the airport. Obsessed. Highly recommend. All right, I'm going to go now, guys, because I'm sleepy. Hello. Good morning.
today is thursday the 19th of may and the weather's not great but we're not manifesting that it's gonna last it's just so windy guys and i open the door i would open it but you will not be able to hear me and honestly it sounds like i'm about to take off so look, let me show you these palm trees the movement there they are <coughs> Oh my god, can you see that? It's bloody windy. So yes, that's a bit annoying. I'm actually gonna go get an acai bowl and either a coffee or a juice. I can't have like any type of milk, whether it's like standard milk or like milk replacement. Two hours either side of taking these pills. So I'm trying to work out when to have my coffee or if I should have one at all. But I do think I need one, I'm kind of like a zombie. Yeah, but I'm gonna go and get some breakfast because I'm hungry and I'm bored i just feel like i'm just not doing anything so yeah that's the plan okay guys our food's here i don't know if you can hear us because the wind is just coming down like a bloody i don't know but here we go <laughs> baby's foot <laughs> hello okay so Hang on, I'm actually going to grab the blanket because I'm actually getting too cold. Can we take these with us to the restaurant? Just wear them around the town? Okay, so update. I actually haven't updated you at all. Basically, we woke up this morning. We were cold, we were well, hungry. Cold, we no. no, we were cold, we were naked, are we there? No, but that's a him. I don't want to offend anyone. Why? We're not that filthy. Maybe. Anyway, we woke up this morning and it was freezing cold. So, we spent most of the day inside. I actually had a little nap outside, but it was cold. So... <laughs> We had this no, book. Had, right, no. It was, it, it got a bit warmer, but you know when you're sunbathing and it's windy, you get tanned, and Georgia just couldn't really get her head around that. She was like, oh, surely not, surely not. She got burned. She got burned. Well, no, so we, anyway, that was today, but now we've come to V Lounge again, because we came on Tuesday and we liked it so much and we wanted a good table, so we came this evening, which was a great idea, and it's beautiful and it's stunning, and we're really happy and grateful to be here. It's just a little bit on the colder side, so we've got a, Colder side. I think you'll like it for snow. Do you know what? It's actually really, really chilly, and none of us are the only person that's dressed a little bit more weather appropriate is you. Yeah. Um. Yeah. I've got this thin little shirt on. It's just not. I've got the brains of the group, everyone. It's not doing it. So <laughs> we're a little bit cold. My next drink might be like a mold wine, but you know, <laughs> it's, it's stunning. Like, look behind. Like, come on. <laughs> Like oh, that is that okay. is what dreams hot, are made hot, of. Sorry, a hot toddy. <laughs> Don't you think that is just stunning? It's like I'm sorry when I eat it, it might not be as yeah, well taken as I thought it might be. It's more. But it's exceeded all my Yeah. There we go, lads. If you're thinking, hang on, let's rotate you. There we go. Let's get balance with my hair's absolutely crazy. No, I want to check you're in focus. <laughs> I put it off so long because I always heard it was like so expensive or like it's not as good as they say it's going to be on Instagram or whatever but it's I'd say I thought it would be like a 10 it's like 20 there we go so cool. Olivia how's yours experience well, yeah, okay, let's do an experience, oh, of, the experience, here. experience of the holiday. Experience of the holiday. Experience of the holiday would be $10,000. Wow. Wow. Is that because yeah. of the company? Yeah. Oh, it's just beautiful. Yeah, it's stunning. So nice. Cheers, everyone. Cheers. I'm metaphorically cheers. I know, I feel really sad. Yeah, let's do a cheers. Hey, y'all. Little morning out of the day. Let's show you guys. I don't have a tripod, so I'm just gonna hold you there. This bikini is a pretty little thing. These are the bottoms, they're really flipping cute. Uh, this little dress is ASOS. So yeah, that's the outfit of the day. If you've already done that, it's quite windy, but it's sunny. Um, I love these Gucci platforms that I bought forever ago. I swear they are like my just favorite shoe. They're so cute, but I'm not actually gonna wear them because they're too high for the pool. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to come on and say hi. We went out for dinner last night. We ended up eating really, let's punch the lamp, really late. So I don't even know if I filmed it. Um, we went to Argo, which I've heard really good things about. And do you know what? The food is 10 out of 10 there. The food is good. So if you can get a reservation there, I do recommend it. I've heard that they can be kind of rude. And I've tried to go there before and they were so rude. <laughs> um, two years ago. But the manager at our hotel 
was actually already in the restaurant. He was like, come in, come in. So we kind of like sauntered in the restaurant and then they were able to get us a table. And the girl that served us was so nice. The world's nicest girl. So I think it's just like who you get on the night. Um, but yeah, it was really good food. And then we were going to go for like a drink afterwards, but we were like all kind of exhausted. We'd had two bottles of wine at dinner and we were just tired. I've got a little bit of heat rash on my chest as well, so I've got to be careful today. But I'm going to just go out, sit in the sun, have a nice coffee and enjoy my day. I'm trying to find half my belongings. Here's what you having for your dinner? What you having for your tea tonight? I'm having for the tea. I'm having jacket theatre, tuna meal, salad and a bit of garlic bread. <laughs> Anyway, this is what we're having for our tea. It's tea lunch. No, it's lunch. It's tea is lunch. It's breakfast dinner. No, breakfast lunch dinner. Sorry. So what's tea? Breakfast dinner tea. Right. I'm really joking. My dad says dinner for lunch sometimes. So what's the lunch? My dad's from New, like family's from Newcastle. Is that why Liverpool? Is that where they say it? Yeah, quite wrong. Right. There we go. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning to you. It's actually not the morning, it's actually nearly 8 pm. And it's been raining since what, four? There's some fours in this house. There's some I don't know, fours. maybe a little bit later than four. Sorry, I'm trying to swallow these front pieces. It's been raining for a little while um, and it's very great and it's actually quite cold. So we're ready to go. Did the lights just come on automatically or did you do that? I clapped my hands and it came on. That was really clever. I've got this outfit on. It's this little bralette from Zara, trousers Zara, shirt, elbow attire. <coughs> denim jacket is actually not my favorite denim jacket, which is kind of really annoyed me that I brought this one. I didn't mean to bring this one. This is an old Topshop denim jacket and it's like, it's okay, but I have an All Saints one that I love and I stupidly got them muddled up. Oh, there's something in that pocket. It felt like there was something in that pocket. There is something in there. You're gonna have to edit that. It's a mask. Okay, so yeah, just wanted to say hi really. Hands free, baby. And then for my handbag, sorry it's cricket, but you know, beggars can't be choosers, this is the angle. This is my plait, which I love. For my handbag, I think I'm gonna do, I'm a bit stuck actually. My scalp's flaking. Are you serious? Nice, isn't it? I'm gonna do this bag, the bum bag. I have the speedy, but it doesn't really, it's not practical. So I think I'm gonna do the bum bag today. I do love this little speedy. If you thinking about getting it because they've brought it out now like a newer version of it i've heard this is not this is vintage but um vintage. no but the newer one's a bit bigger and i actually think it looks really quite useful and good but obviously isn't like there's zero point having two of the same bag but yeah i do love this bag it's cute anyway so yeah i think i'm gonna use this just because it fits so much in it i actually love this bag it's really underrated had its moment for me but it's still going strong so i just really want to start the vlog because we haven't started the vlog today i've got severe heat rash phoebe's here the girls have just gone just the two of us we can make it if we try just the two of us you and i i've been so bad at vlogging i feel this week hey guys we're just sitting by the beach today it is so hot it's not it's nice I might go on a little stroll because I, I get a bit restless. It's like a child, honestly. I literally could sizzle in this all day, not move. Mum, can we go in the sea? Can we go up in the sea? I get bored. I might go on a little stroll. Hi everyone, welcome to my vlog. Welcome back to the channel. Whose accent's that? It's yours. No, it's not. Hi you guys, welcome back to the channel. My name's Phoebe. Okay. And you might know me from telly. Have we got the key? Yes. Oh. Who's got the magic in me? La 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 Yes, it's time to go. I don't know that song. Oh, it's chili con carne. I want to get a pair. Shock. Yeah, if you, if I had a pound for every time you said I want to get a pick, I would be a fucking billion a zillionaire. There we go. There we go. Oh. <laughs> Let's get it out of my system. <coughs> oh. She's 
it's off again. Say hi guys. Hi guys. This is so. I think we've said this is the final night, which we're really like bittersweet about. Like, yeah. Kind of want to go home. Kind of want to see the dogs. You want to see yeah, your lovely see my dogs. Yeah, my dog. Dennis. You want to see Dennis. Love of your life. Uh, which, if you're not aware of, Dennis is literally Phoebe's love since I can't believe since the start of time. Yeah. So, but we're still gutted because we love it here. And the it's weather's nice great. And Everyone's friendly. Yeah. I just love, I love it. I'm a bit gutted. Yeah, so. But like, we'll be like, going to come back. Three more days. So. Yeah, easily. Yeah. yeah. We are going to come back. Like, I want to come back and like just go back to Oya and San Antonio. And I love Kamari. And there's 101 things I'll say, I think. And we've been given a nice little I mean, I do have okay. mine, but. It's currently being used as a tripod for this vlog. Vlog as I keep calling it. What was your favourite moment of the trip? Last night. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't vlog last night. Um, it was pissing down My favourite moment of the trip was. I just love going to Sierra. So, the sunset. I think V Lounge was a highlight. It was not cold. It's cold. Yeah. I think Tuesday was yeah. really better than Thursday. I think the whole time. I'm not, there's not really been any standout. I just love sitting in the sun. Like it's my favourite thing to do. It's a bit too much, isn't it? Like I, I do yeah, sit out a bit too much. Like to enjoy yourself and relax. <coughs> feel so zen when I'm there. You know when people do like yoga? That's, that's the matter. Just lying in the Vitamin sun. Vitamin D is your yoga. Lying in the yoga. sun literally sends me out. Like I could, I just love it. It has been really nice though. Would definitely, rec definitely recommend Santorini, wouldn't we? If you're thinking about it. <coughs> Friends, lovers, family, kids. Multi people. Yeah. Right, we're gonna go and enjoy our last meal. Oh, hopefully we're not our last meal, our last meal here. <laughs> our last ever meal. So, what are we doing? We're eating absolutely the white girl wasted. Guys, I've had three glasses of Prosecco and a Bailey's coffee and I'm about to go and have a How cookie walkie woo. How are the kids doing? The kids aren't moving. <laughs> but I'm about to have a cookie walkie woo. What? A cookie walkie woo? A cookie walkie woo. <laughs> have a nice cookie. Have you never heard of that? Tell me and Kayla say that all the time. What cookie are you getting tonight? We go out. We're, uh, we're like, I mean, oh, what one are you gonna go for? What cookie are you gonna get? <coughs> I have to cut that out now. <laughs> Jesus Christ! It, I do it just for you when you're editing that. It's so annoying because I hate editing. I, I enjoy making me watch everything and edit it. Because normally I just post it and I don't even edit. Just be natural, be authentic. Oh my god, that, that is me. Oh my god, <laughs> my eyes burning. Oh. Burning red. Right, we're gonna go and have a drink. Bye. Follow me on IG, Phoebe underscore Ruben. Thank you. Wow, Phoebe Ruben. Tell us what it's like.